Hello guys and welcome to my YouTube channel Blender Star. Today we are going to show you the five ways to rig a character. So we will use Blender and we will also use some other add-ons, some website to make your rig very easy and advanced. So we will start from the very beginning way and then we will go to advanced. So let's get started. So the first method is the Maxamo website rig. So it's a website where you can get a lot of animated uh, characters and you can also rig your own character and also you can animate it. So for this you, you just need a character. So for example this is my character so I need an FBX or OBJ file for it. So we will export an FBX file. You can uh, also check my setting and I will do it for desktop, base mesh. Okay and we will export it now we will go to our website simply go to the megzamo.com uh, the link is also in the description so you can access it from here so there is two options sign up for free or login so i already have sign up i create an id for it so if you didn't have then then click on this normally add uh, email email and password and you will get a free account but I already have one so I will click on login and I will click on the Google one which I already have an account okay so after that click on upload character so you can browse your character from here or you can simply go to your desktop and drag the file here okay so we are ready to rig it if you uh, get any error you can comment and I will reply on that so I can answer it so if you get this process done then go to next and click grab the chin one and make it to the chin the vessels to here this one to this you can also get it from this there is a reference image for it so we will make the knees to the knees and if your character is not symmetrized you can also use this option use symmetrical or not and you can also make it with fingers standard no finger and anything you want and the final one we will make it here now we'll go click on next okay so I click on next next and there we have our character rig if I click on an animation I can check how it react on any of the animations so as you can see my rig is successful and it's working properly you can also add animations here so add animations and when you like it simply click on download so you can also do it with animation or without skin uniform non uniform okay so we will click on with skin and we will simply download you can also remove animation from here okay so now we will go to the blender again so after finishing the download simply go to your download go here press f4 import fbx and drag your fbx there now import and you will get this one select the bonds go to the setting go to the viewport display and make it in front to see the bonds and there we have we get opposed we get our character rigged with animations so if we play it as you can see there we go okay so the simple method is spared but it's believe me it's really advanced and powerful so this method is the add-on called auto rig so go to your edit preference and turn on it if you download it from the given link in the description so i already have this so i will search for auto rig and let's check it make it save and with this one you can also do it the face rigging so the full tutorial link is in the description uh, here I will show you a demo so go to the smart one 
get selected objects add neck add chin add shoulder root and let's go now click on match to rig go to the object mode select your character then shift and select your rig go to skin and make it bend after some time go to the pose and there we have a complete character rig So the third method is also very simple and really helpful. So in this case you need to find a rig character online for free. Go to any of these website and pick a rig 3D model. So I already get this one. So simply go to the object setting, select your bond, control C to copy and control C to paste it here, control V to paste it here, scale it down, go to your edit and normally make some adjustment. After that go to the object setting, select your character and then click on your rig, Control P and make it with automatic weights. Select your rig Hello everyone. and I there you have it. You like if you like it, like, subscribe and share. Don't forget to put your suggestions in the comments below. My next video is going to be something special, especially for people my age. In so fourth method, there is another add-on which is completely free and also built in with Blender. So go to edit, preference and search for Rigify. Check this, let's save it, close, shift A. Go to your rig, armator. And you will get all of these options just click on the basic or anyone you want so here for demo I will click on basic go to your setting make it in front scale it up just like the other one make some adjustment So do it per one side, delete the another one. Now select the right one. Shift D to duplicate it with go with X scale minus one. So we will get the mirror one. Grab this one to X and let's fit it something like this now select your body then rig control p and make it with automatic pets after that go to pause mode and there you have your rig this one is uh, pretty much advanced also you can also generate your rig which will give you something like this so also there are a lot of tutorials on youtube channel so i will also put a link in the description so you can check it from there so the number five method is the simple basic manual rig so it's also really simple same as other so in this method we go to simple single bone we grab it there go and make it in front scale it down go to edit mode select this one and extrude it up one more time make one for neck and one for head now select this one and make it shift D duplicate 
rotate it something like this grab it there and now start extruding something like this again shift D duplicate this one rotate this one grab it something like this extrude it one more time and from the right side extrude it one last time so now select it with left click shift D to duplicate S X minus 1 and there we have a mirror of it grab it so after extruding you will get this kind of structure now we need to go to the object mode select your body then select your armature Control P make it with automatic pads select your armature go to pose mode and there you have Hello everyone, I hope you liked this video. If you like it, like, subscribe and share. Don't forget to put your suggestions in the comments below. My next so video hope you liked the video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more interesting videos. For now, bye.